Well, hi again ladies and gentlemen. Today I wanted to talk about my hair a little bit. Um, it's been three days since I said them for the last time. And as you can see they're still kind of nice and wavy. And I know. But um, they're a little bit out of shape and not really that bouncy anymore. So I will have to set them again tonight. And I will talk to you a little bit about how I do this normally. Well, I do a wet set with foam rollers. And uh, normally when I come out of the shower I wait till my hair is almost dry and then I start rolling them. And I have a special secret I want to share with you. And that is my setting lotion. It is really simple but really effective. And um, you only need two ingredients for that. And one of it is water, just normal plain water. And the second thing is these guys here. Flex seats. It is super easy, you just uh, put three quarters of a cup of water into a little uh, pan or something like that and you take one tablespoon of flax seeds and boil it up and let it simmer about for 10 to 15 minutes and this is so amazing it's the product that comes out of it but I gotta tell you, it's not me who came up with this. I read this in a blog of a wonderful lady. And I will uh, post a link below so you can go visit the site and read how you do this. But I just wanted to share my experience with these flax seeds. Apparently, it says in this blog that women in the 40s used to use this method for making their setting a lotion so I was like okay let's try this and it's really amazing it uh, doesn't it, it sets your hair so good and it will stay in and strong for a long time like as I said this is the third day and I haven't done my hair in three days I did this uh, roller set three days ago and they still look like that. Yeah. And it doesn't stay in your hair at all. It's just amazing. And authentically 40s apparently. So I recommend for everyone who would like to do wet sets taking a try in this setting lotion because it's amazing. Yeah. I will go make my special wonder lotion and set my hair and I'll see you back then. Okay, hey you guys, I'm back. Please excuse my makeupless face, I'm just about to go to bed. And I know it might not look that appealing, whatever. I just set my hair and I wanted to show you the mixture I made really quickly. I keep it in this container. It used to be uh, a container for directions hair dye and I thought it was pretty useful so I can store my setting lotion in it. I don't know whether you can tell but like the texture is not really that nice looking but it doesn't matter as soon as it's in your hair because it really does magic yeah um, and I wanted to t uh, share some of my experiment uh, bleh, bleh. I'm sorry <laughs> my tongue is really twisted right now sorry 
some of my experiences I made with this. If you have uh, are finished boiling it up, you should uh, take it care. You get all of the flax seeds out of this, and this can really be a little tricky if you don't have a lot of experience with it. So it will get better the more often you do it. Um, yeah, it's not that bad if you got some flax seeds in your hair. You can brush them out afterwards. But it's really a little tricky not getting in too much of them. And you shouldn't, uh, you should just take like a single strand of hair, take a little of this mixture, dampen the strand a little bit, and then roll it up. Yeah, then let it set overnight. I will take the curls out tomorrow and hopefully they will look really good as always. Um, I forgot to mention one really big pro for this. It's totally cruelty free and it's super healthy like it doesn't have anything artificial in it so Go for it and use it. If you want to see how my hair turns out, I will hopefully post a video tomorrow. And don't forget to check out Noir Girl's blog. It's really nice. I like it a lot. Um, yeah. See you. Have a good night. Bye bye.